It's all the rage and it's all anybody is talking about right now. Gemini's Nano Banana model is absolutely incredible. The accuracy, the speed, it's just completely unmatched and is blowing some already existing very, very good AI models just out of the water. And today I wanted to put it to the test specifically in mocking up different designs that have a lot of detail because one of the things that other current AI models really, really struggle with is preserving details and not changing the things that you're not asking it to change. So it's really difficult to get consistent generations across different mock-ups and characters and different photos. But this is really where Nano Banana shines and you don't have to use it directly in Gemini's chat window. You can use it directly in Kittle with Flow. So you can have your whole map of all your designs and all of your mock-ups all in one place. So let's jump in the editor and try it out. So I've taken the liberty of going ahead and procuring some of these different designs here and we're going to put this to the test. Some of them are more simple, others like this one down here are more complex. And so I just wanted to use flows to mock them up with the Nano Banana AI model. So what we can do is if we have our artboard here with your design or a template or whatever, it doesn't matter what it is, you can click the arrow right here to add a smart board and then boom right here on the right you see nano banana and describe your variation with a prompt so what i want to do is say mock this design up in the center of the chest on a heavy weight white t-shirt and let's see what that does all right, already pretty good, pretty, pretty good, pretty good. It's looking nice and it only took 15 seconds. Now what we can do from here, the arrow again, and we can describe some more variations. Like so let's say I wanted to zoom out to show the entire t-shirt and make the design a little bit smaller. So let's ask it to do that. Zoom out so you can see the entire t-shirt and make the design slightly smaller on the shirt. Also thicken up the collar of the shirt and let's see what that does. And as you can see, didn't even take 15 seconds. We have this design mocked up on a heavyweight white t-shirt. Absolutely incredible. We could take this convert it to an image, we could remove the background. So we have our t-shirt without a background, we could place it anywhere and do anything that we want with it. Let's go on to the next design. We can do add smart board or you can click the arrow there. Mock up this design on the back of a black heavyweight hoodie. And let's see this. And I mean, this is, this is incredible. Like all of the details all like the same amount of stars here as in the original image this is a perfect flat lay of a black hoodie i mean this is just insane make the design a bit bigger on the back of the hoodie remember you have to kind of prompt like an art director right you have to think about the different details of things so if your ai is not really giving you anything close to what you want consider your prompts first before saying that the ai is doing a bad job Cool, we've got the design a bit bigger here, looking nice. Let's go show me a man wearing this hoodie standing in an all white studio. He is facing away from the camera so you can see the back. Not even 15 seconds, guys, not even 15 seconds. And we have a perfect product mock-up it's perfect it is the same as the design it like it is perfect i'm dumbfound even making this video right now in this moment i am dumbfound this is the perfect mock-up let's go down to this one this it's so good it's making me upset mock this design on a bag i want the design to be white and the bag to be black let's try that so now we're, we're introducing some challenges. We're changing the color of the design to put on a different colored product. 10 seconds, 10 seconds, 10 seconds. And it's preserved all of the details. I mean, look at this. See the good, you got this. I mean, it's just so, so good. Let's do show me a woman standing 
in a coffee shop with this tote bag on her arm. There are botanical flowers coming out of the tote bag. We're throwing curveballs. We're getting wild. We're gonna see how this does. I mean, most of these generations have not even taken the full 15 seconds. I mean, this is, this is, this is incredible. This is absolutely insane. Add Harry Potter ordering a coffee in the background. So that's just a curveball we're just gonna see. <laughs> I said add Harry Potter ordering a coffee in no. the background. No, no. <laughs> Dude, no. are you serious? That is Daniel Radcliffe. That is the boy. Goodness sakes. No copyright. We don't we don't own the rights to Daniel Radcliffe or Harry Potter. Nor are we going to sell that image or show that image anywhere. So just be careful, guys. Be careful out there. Be careful out there. I'm going to change the color, the background color of this design to white just so we don't get confused here. Show this design on the back of a white short sleeve heavyweight t-shirt. I mean, I'm still in all of this. You can see it's not changed anything. We're not AI slopping it, you know? Oh my goodness. I mean, that's just uh, like, it makes me upset. Show me a woman standing in an all white studio wearing this t-shirt. She has on black baggy jeans and pink adidas sambas on. She is facing away from the camera so you can see the back of the shirt. I mean, this is, this is just so. This, hmm. I mean, I, I like it. I'm, gosh. I'm finding it. Add cat walking into D frame. I mean, this is so good. Like it focuses on what you want it to do without changing the things that you don't want it to change. That's incredible. Preserving details, doing it quickly, mock-ups. I mean, like we're arriving to a point where it's so good that I don't understand how it could get any better. And it's in Kittle. If you've never tried Kittle Flows and you're interested in using Nano Banana, try it out today. Make sure you're subscribed to the Kittle YouTube page so you get more awesome updates like this and leave a comment. Is this wild? This is awesome. Let us know what you're going to use Nano Banana to do, how this is going to help your design business or your POD business or any of the things that you're doing. Make sure to also leave a like on this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one.